Hey ladies, it is Thursday and this is Stacy, your Thursday vlogger. Um, update. How am I doing? Um, today is the first day in about a month or more that I have my body bug on and I am back to tracking or not doing the visual calorie counting or thinking I'm doing okay. I have meticulously, however you say that, put my calories and stuff in um, my manager today. And so summer is coming and I have nothing to wear and I don't want to be another summer of hiding underneath my my clothes. And yeah, we got too many things going on that I don't want to be hiding and wah, 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 wah on that whole thing. Um, I'm not going down the hill, but I, I, I haven't moved anywhere. You know, I keep fluctuating the first few pounds. Uh, great, yeah. Maintaining or, you know, if you go up those couple pounds here and there and down, you know, maintaining status as I would say that's great but this isn't the size I want to maintain at so yeah um, throughout my I had a little notebook that I started like five years ago my first initial weight like 250 something 252 and all my stats threw that out the other day I said um, you know enough looking back from how many years ago it's kinda of like I'm, I'm starting a new again from the weight that I had kinda of pre or regained from my weight um, from my surgery and being inactive and all that good stuff. So I'm starting a new, so I have a new journal book to start my measurements and weight again, which I'm going to probably do that in a couple days after kind of detoxing my body here and being really strict and um, consistent at my calorie counting. I will probably um, bite the bullet and do my measurements and stuff like that in here. So yeah, topic of the week is trigger foods. What triggers me to like binge or not stay on plan? I have a lot of them, but I think my main ones would be like pizza, any type of chip, and any real, real sweet like candy, not like a, not, um, not like a hard candy, but like a candy bar or a really chocolatey type of uh, cake or something like that really concentrated you know just really spikes my insulin level and then leaves me wanting more or mentally I have a food mentally messes me up if I am on plan all day and I maybe have that one little bingey I mean and it might even not be like a binge but it's off plan type of food it really throws me through a loop and like I think oh for the rest of the day I'm just screw it I'll start again tomorrow and you know you keep doing that every day you're getting a lot of excess calories and stuff in so I'm, I'm working with that and I'm working around um, still my boredom eating type of stuff in the home I'm really uh, it's kind of like a broken record I really have finally really triggered my not triggered but I've you know been able to really pinpoint down that being working in this home and not feeling as um, accomplished in some parts of my life that it's really making me not care not you know not care about what I am I, I don't have to leave the house and do this and that as often so when I do have an engagement or we have a party to go to or we have something and I have to then dress up or I have to do something that's when it kicks in and I just could kick myself in the butt thinking what am I doing what am I thinking you know I don't I don't get that enough for people who work out of the home that have to maybe dress up and not like real dressy but just you don't have to that public appearance or just kind of keep up you know you're more aware of um, you're more aware of your body and how you're looking and how you're feeling we're here you know I work with kids and they love you no matter what they you know I'm sorry they do they they're unconditional love as long as you give them plenty of love they love you right back so um, so yeah I, I'm working around that for um, my struggles right here and now so I'm going to probably be updating soon on my personal challenge, talking about my body bug, and I'm starting to get a few miles in, or starting, I'm going to track in here as well. Um, now that the weather is really getting warm, I'm start upping my um, my mileage to get ready for my Minnesota, you know, 300 mile bike tour. So, um, if you want to check into my channel here soon, my personal channel, I will be, you know, going more in depth a little bit on what I'm doing. Um, and on my body bug, it has a new feature where it, you can post you up to um, Facebook. I might do it twice a day. I have 
friends and family that kind of support me and it what it does is it'll you can check what you want it to report so it can report my calories calories burn intake sleep I mean every category but you can check what you want to be posted as an update um, so like I posted my calories that I'm that's showing that my body is burning my intake my steps and my activity how you know how many minutes of activity moderate to vigorous activity and then I'll get um, updated every once in a while on my Facebook status and I thought that's kind of cool because you know it's nice to there are people who are rooting for me I know and it's showing me that I can that's how I can show them that I'm doing the work versus e you know you don't email everybody every day hey I'm doing this and I'm doing that it's just a way to kind of show them, oh, you know, she's been busy today, or oh, she didn't have a very good day, or, um, yeah. So that's a new little feature that I'm, um, gonna see how it helps to motivate me. Everybody, take care and have a really warm um, weekend because it's gonna be beautiful here. So I'm really planning on getting some um, physical activity in. <laughs> take care, bye.